Thank you. Oh my God. <laughs> Time to kick it with Kenny Crumpton on East 185th Street this morning. Good morning. Good morning, Chris. Good morning, Wayne. Let me tell you, they're doing some great things over here, really boosting the economy here and giving great opportunities for lots of incredible mom and pop businesses to shine. Monica, that's where you come in. This is your space. And everybody in here, yes. you want to give them a chance to, to become successful business men and women like you have been. Absolutely. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. So we are um, offering everything you see this mm -hmm. Saturday. Mm -hmm. Um, that's July 31st yep. from 11 to 4. Okay. And we're at 616 East 185th Street. So we're expecting that Cleveland shows up and comes out and supports every vendor here. Let's hope so because there's amazing stuff in here. We're going to come over here now. It's Nefera, correct? Nefera. You spent four years on your chocolate chip yes. cookie recipe. Four years. Four years. And then there's a secret ingredient from South America that helps you out. So tell us about. Uh, Fairy Godmother Cookies. Fairy Godmother Cookies was created with my daughter in mind. Mm -hmm. We were developing a relationship in baking, and that's how I used to speak with her and talk to her, encourage her to be an entrepreneur okay. by using these wonderful baked goods, mm -hmm. chocolate chip cookies, oatmeal, raisins, and they're peanut made from butter, scratch. and sugar made and from you scratch. You, you package them like this, and these really yes. cool. I package them in these really cool boxes. Mm -hmm. They're beautiful. Um, they're for any occasion that yeah. you would like to display. It's amazing. And they're very tasty because I had one. Yes. And what's your name? Marissa. Nice to meet you, Marissa. Okay, Fairy Godmother Cookies. Okay, Ascension, House of Ascension. Good morning. Good morning. And what is your name? Tanisha. Tanisha, tell us about your products. Whatever we see here, it smells like what we see. Just like what you see. So I make food candles mm -hmm. and as you can see I have pies and ice cream and cupcakes and I make these right out of my kitchen. Wow and yes. they smell like so <laughs> this sm actually smells like what is this? That is a key lime pie. Key lime pie. Yes. It smells like chicken. I'm just kidding. <laughs> it smells like key lime pie. And so now um, how long does it take you to make it? Because you're making these by hand. So how long does it take you to make um, all these? Again? Every candle is hand poured, and it takes anywhere from an hour to three hours, sometimes 24 hours. So to it's make. pretty labor intensive. But something yes. like this, you get to keep the cup. Right? Yes, you can keep the cup. Everything that you see, they come in different types of packaging. Yeah. Some come in little boxes like these. How did you come up with the idea to make these? So actually, I started making regular candles. Okay. Um, they didn't move as well, so <laughs> I started making food something? candles. Okay. Right. I'm keto, so I can't eat desserts and stuff. Mm. My husband was like, "Why don't you make it look like what it smells like?" Okay. And I was like, "Ah." But people shouldn't eat these, though. Don't eat these. Okay. Whatever awesome. you do. <laughs> well, they they are amazing. Let me tell you, I, I smell them. They they smell. But how, real quickly, how long do they last? Would you say? Um, um, Ballpark. The burn time is from five to eight hours, okay. and if you don't burn them, they last forever. Well, of course, yes. All right. <laughs> There's a burn ratio, something you yes. learned about too, didn't you? Yes. Okay, so this Saturday, 11 to 4, again, Paj, give us a wide shot. Look at all these amazing vendors. We're going to try to show incredible. at least show them on air. Wayne is pretty amazing. Let me uh, tell you. Yes. All right, back that's to you guys in the studio. That's awesome. Four years to make chocolate chip cookies. I would love to taste oh, I would like to taste those too. Kenny, can you bring one back? Please. <laughs>